Hello, welcome to another episode of Home Cooking with Susan Zhang. Today, we're going to be making Vietnamese spring rolls. For this recipe, you need sliced onion, grated carrot, minced garlic, minced fresh water chestnuts, minced pork, minced fresh shrimp, fish sauce, eggs, cloud ear mushrooms, mung bean vermicelli, and spring roll wrappers. I'm going to show you how to prepare the cloud ear mushrooms. When you cut it up, there's a tough core that you don't want to use, otherwise it's too chewy. So you just shred the rest of them. The mung bean vermicelli, as you can see, I've rehydrated it. It takes about 10 minutes in warm water. So you just mix everything together. Now I'm adding in some salt, black pepper, and eggs, which will help bind the ingredients together. After you've mixed the filling, the next step is to roll the spring rolls. My Vietnamese friend in San Francisco taught me a secret. He said if you mix a sugary drink into the soaking water, it will make the spring rolls brown faster. So you add water, and it doesn't have to be Coke. So it's very crisp at the beginning, but a quick dip in the liquid. And I lay them out and I do it assembly style. Now you just add some of the filling to the wrapper. Slightly off center, because then it'll roll better. Roll it up, roll on the sides, and then continue rolling to the end. After wrapping the spring rolls, you need to fry them. And as with all things that I fry, I double fry. The first frying cooks the interior and the second frying crisps up the exterior. So you add oil to your pan. It doesn't have to be a wok, but it's convenient. So when the oil is ready, you just add in a few at a time. And then you should flip them when they're about halfway done. After the first frying, as you can see, the color is not very good. So that's why when you fry it the second time, it will brown it and crisp it up. And another advantage of double frying is that you can fry in advance the first time. And then when your guests arrive, you can fry it the second time and it'll be hot. The second frying doesn't take that long, maybe just about a minute or so. You just want to brown it. And you need to turn them around a lot so they brown even evenly. Now, as you can see, the color after it's been fried the second time is a lot browner um, and it's crunchy. It's, it's more crisp. So you make a quick sauce with fish sauce, you add a bit of sugar and you dissolve it in, some fresh lime juice. and rice vinegar. And then you dilute it with some water. And you mix in carrots. fresh chilies. And there you have it, Vietnamese spring rolls. You can eat it by, by itself or you get the Thai basil 
fresh mint and a lettuce leaf and then you just dip the spring roll into the sauce and eat it. Thank you for watching. I'm Susan Jung for the South China Morning Post.